Welcome to Cloud Dolls. As you have seen in the thumbnail, we're going back to the world of My Little Pony. This time with Fluttershy. She's a female Pegasus pony and one of the main characters of My Little Pony. Friendship is magic. She lives in a small cottage near the ever free forests and take care of animals. She represents the element of kindness. For that, I choose Katrine de Mau from Monster High. She missed an arm, but it's okay because I have to change the color of the body. I bought this amazing lace with the butterflies and this pink curly hair and I'm gonna decorate it with flowers and butterflies and I cannot wait for that. First I'm gonna do all the steps that are usually normal. Just cut the hair really short. Oh, I'm sorry Fleur Shy. I forgot that you were shy. Oh, I have to do this quickly. With my hair dryer I make the vinyl soft and take the head out of the body and with a scuba driver I pull the rest of the hair from the neck hole. With acetone I take the factory makeup out. You see, I noticed that she has some uh, marks. I have to use the Acne Creme. All of the cremes that have benzoyl peroxide are good. Just put a big potion of it and leave it for 48 hours in the sun. And then they are gone. Till we wait that that happens, I'm going to use the satin ribbon to make the top of the dress and close it with some Velcro. I use this green tool. I'm gonna cut a rectangle to make the skirt of the dress. Together with a beautiful lace with butterflies. Fluttershy's special talent is communicating with animals, which she uses in order to provide them with food, medical attention, and other forms of care when they need it. In addition, and a host of animals have taken up residence in her home, which she attends to and look after on an everyday basis. And that's how he looks. I'm loving it. Now with a little bit of green tool, I'm going to embellish the top of the dress. the dress is ready. After 48 hours we clean the face and you see it's gone. Now I'm gonna reroute the head with this amazing pink synthetic hair and this time I didn't forgot the paint sculpt. And yet, <laughs> I had to forget something. I forgot to cut the ears. She's supposed to be a pony, not a cat. So she doesn't need them. After five hours of rerouting, that's how she looks. And I'm gonna seal it everything 
with tacky glue and make sure that cover all the hair and let leave it dry for the night. Now the body. I have to change the hand because she have a cloud and a pony doesn't have claws. So I'm gonna replace it for a normal hand. And it's time to send the body and clean it with nail polish without acetone. And with a layer of Mr. Super Clear, let it dry for 30 minutes. I paint the arm and the ends in white. I seal it again with Mr. Super Clear and let it dry for 30 minutes. And with my watercolor pencils and my soft pastels, it's time to start the face. I have to give her a yellow skin and the only doll that I have yellow is this one and no, I'm not gonna use it. I don't think it's the best idea so I have really to change the color of the body. I'm gonna use the technique of soft pastels and layers of Mr. Super Clear. I give it two layers in the face and now it's time to sketch the face with my watercolor pencils. I start with a light brown, give it the shape that I want it. I give it turquoise eyes with some pink soft pastel I give it some blush and the place where I want the eyebrows Where are you going? My camera decided to go away. <laughs> now with white acrylic paint that I diluted in a little bit of water, I make her sclera more white. The final highlights 
and uh, the catch light of the eyes. With the soft pastels, again, it's time for the body. I will give it the same treatment that I give it to the face. But for the body, I needed four layers. I spray it with Mr. Super Clear between the layers, letting dry for 30 minutes. And now I'm gonna paint her the panties in pink because she's a lady and it's time to put the body together with the head and she looks so cute now with my 3D printer I print these accessories, the shoes and the wings. The shoes I'm gonna paint them with a light pink. And the wings with the yellow, the same color of the body. Now with the female sticker product for the gold leaves I'm gonna brush the shoes leave it for 15 minutes and I'm gonna apply the pink metal leaf I will protect everything with my varnish high glossy. This doll is going to be available on my Etsy shop. If you need a flutter shine in your life, you know where to find it in the, my description box below. I'm going to finish the shoes with this light pink ribbon and with a gold butterfly in the back side. It's time to decorate the dress with the flowers and with the same gold butterflies. And I printed also the symbol of Fluttershy that I'm gonna glue it directly in the dress with the flowers. And I do this for the rest of the dress. And it's time for the high lashes. I'm using doll high lashes and tacky glue and some paints to put them in place. I finish her face with some glossy varnish in the lips and in the eyes. Are you ready to see our Flutter Shine? There she is! I have to tell you something, I love her. I am in love with her. I think she's so beautiful, so light. She really represents everything that Fluttershine is and everything that the spring is. Don't forget to subscribe my channel, like it, leave a comment. I read all of your comments. They are really important for me. And I see you in my next video. Bye!